It is common when working with spreadsheets to create a single cell formula and then duplicate it with a fill to create a column or row. So it's important to get that first formula right. A cell formula is an expression that defines the operations for calculating the value of a cell. It might be a constant or contain mathematical operators or functions and it can reference a single cell, a range of cells, or none at all. A cell formula begins with an equal sign. This cell is now equal to whatever I type to the right of the equal sign. That can be a number. It could be a math operation like addition or multiplication of two constants. It could be a reference to some other cell. If the original cell is referenced with a formula, then a change to the original cell will automatically change the one that references it. Besides constants and references, functions can be included in formulas and that's where the true power lies. A function is a built-in routine that calculates a value from inputs provided. Functions always start with some keyword such as sum or average or trim and so on, followed by a set of parentheses with parameters in between. A parameter might be a constant or cell reference or range reference or other expression that is required for the function calculation. It's even possible to nest functions. They can become quite complex. You have to look at the function definition to know what kind of parameters are expected and how they will be used by the function. A function allows us to use data we already have in a new way. There are many types and you can take a closer look at them in the function library on the formula menus tab. You'll learn some useful ones in these introductory lessons. There are over 400 though, so keep in mind that there are more to explore.